Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hi, my name is Madison and I post college related videos specifically based around nursing since I'm in nursing school. Today I'm going to be doing another nursing school week in the life video. So it is Saturday, June something, I'll put it here. And it's like five something right now and I literally cannot focus in my house. The library is not open on the weekends. Another library, like a public library, is also not open, and <laughs> I'm slowly but surely losing my mind because I need, like, complete silence when I study or else I get distracted, so that's that, but I don't know if you can see, I have all my school stuff laying there, so I am going to get started studying, um, I'll briefly just quickly go through like what our first exam is on. So it's on like the nursing process, healthcare delivery, um, elimination, so like constipation, urinary retention, the different types of urinary incontinence, um, fecal incontinence, and also STDs, STIs. And I think that's like pretty much it. Um, so yeah. I'm like not feeling I'm like gonna be completely right with you guys I'm feeling zero motivation and my head hurts <laughs> so yeah and it's also like super hot and sunny out so it's definitely hard like being inside I mean I do like to go outside and study but it gets hot or like distracting and yeah so that's that I hope you guys are all having an amazing summer so far if you're not in classes and if you are in classes i hope you're having an amazing like summer class session i am going on week three out of eight of my classes well kind of eight weeks eight weeks is final week we don't actually have class that week we just have finals so week three of like seven weeks of class um so yeah and i start clinicals on monday i got questions before yes my school is allowing us to do clinicals obviously only at certain hospital locations so I am on a med surge telemetry floor and I'm kind of I don't know I don't like I'm not actually feeling like nervous I know I will be a little bit nervous just because but I do know everyone in my clinical group which is awesome because we have lecture and lab together because it is such a small group in the summer so that's that and uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to sit down and study. I just need to do it. I just need to do it. So we're gonna get started. I need to come up with like a little plan. <laughs> So I just made a to-do list of stuff I want to go over for the exam. So that's that. And then this is for like clinical I put this little clinical sticker from hand can plans Etsy shop I can put it like right here and I'll put it down below and I just kind of use my highlighter to chunk off like the time like that and then I've also been doing that for like my lab in zoom lectures also using her stickers so I'll put that down below and again this is the ivory paper co-planner I'm obsessed with it and I will also link that down below for you guys too I also just got these on Amazon the other day and it came with like a, another yellow one like this but the colors are super pretty and school supplies just motivate me to um study so Yes, we have this here, and now I need to go through all of my school stuff back there and figure out where to start. All right, you guys, so it is time to bust out the drag race board sorry my button is bigger than my head but yeah so I brought this up I get a lot of questions of where I got this it was like a gift when me and my sister were like eight when we like we used to play school but the brand is the board dudes that's the brand so I'm going to get out my dry erase markers and I'm going to go over my SLOs and that is just like the student 
learning outcomes. And I also have in the front here, like all my notes, I've showed you guys these before. And um, someone asked where they can buy these without the lines. I got this made at Staples and I just used like regular printer paper with my stuff that was printed and I already have like notes and stuff and it's cheaper if they don't print it for you. So that's that. So I'm going to start writing on the dry erase board because that is literally how I remember my stuff. <music> use this super tiny dry erase board too i got for like a couple dollars at the drugstore so yeah this one's like super small compared to it. it's probably like the like yeah size of like a normal piece of paper and i just have huge handwriting and it's like messy right here but yeah especially if i want to write a lot out um so again going through this so i got this section done and i'm going to move on to the different types of healthcare agencies Good morning guys. So it is 11. I got up at 10 and I just drove to the hospital where my clinical is at because I wanted to like map out the timing and see where I'm supposed to park and stuff. It helps with my anxiety and getting like super nervous about stuff. So if you can do that, I definitely recommend doing that. I did that for my last clinical rotation at the nursing home and it just kind of like eases my mind a little bit. I am going to be running to Trader Joe's quickly and getting some groceries for my lunch and stuff for tomorrow. It looks so crazy, but yeah, I just spent the rest of the night studying last night and yeah, it's so hot, it's so sunny out, such a pretty day and happy Father's Day too. It's Father's Day right now, um, so I hope you guys had an amazing Father's Day. Guys, so this is what I got from Trader Joe's. I got watermelon, pineapple, carrots, bananas, some pineapple juice, water, these multi-green chips with hummus, grapes, and pancakes for Xander. And then I also got these flowers and then other ones that I put upstairs. So I put my little flowers in my flower jar. If you guys watch my room tour, I am an idiot. <laughs> And yeah, it's like for like baking flour, um, not F-L-O-W-E-R. I apparently wasn't all there when I was getting this. Anyway, so it looks cute anyway. And then I got this little guy. Very nice. This is the best apple juice ever. And then I got a cinnamon sugar bagel from Brugger. So I'm going to eat this. This is like my breakfast slash lunch since I think it's like 12 or something. All right, so I just finished my bagel. It was so good. And now I'm just on Quizlet and I'll show you guys oh, what I did last night. So what I did last night was I typed out in here, typed out everything that I could remember that I learned yesterday. And then I went and checked my work. And then in red, I just added anything I forgot. So not too, too bad. So yeah, that's what I did. And now, good old Quizlet. So I'm just packing my clinical bag. This is my bag. I got it from Target last year or like, yeah, last August. Looks like this has like a pocket for your laptop too. It's from a New Day brand. So I'll just show you. I have a whole video on what I pack and take to clinical, which I can link that down below. So I just have my binder with my clinical paperwork in it. We needed a folder to turn in our clinical paperwork. So I just found one of those in my basement. I have hand sanitizer and wipes just obviously i have two like mini notebooks i use these a lot when i work as like an aide especially at first so this might be nice at first i have my favorite thing in the whole entire world my um clipboard that folds up so we have this i have my pencil case with pens and pencils band-aids so i can cover up my tattoos and then this little thing i got off of amazon has like scissors pen light i have my um pharmacology med cards from the 
fall and I have them all like divided up here. So I'm going to bring those. We don't pass meds until a couple of weeks, um, but I just have those. And then in here, obviously my stethoscope and my pen lights and I have my badge in here too. That's that. Oh, and I have like a watch with two hands, but I'm going to wear my Apple watch. All right. So I laid out everything that I need. This also helps with my anxiety and getting worried. And also I'm a zombie in the morning. I hate waking up early. So yes. I have my shoes here, my bag with all my clinical stuff. I have my scrub top, my scrub jacket, scrub pants, compression socks, there's like lint on them. Um, my Apple Watch, two band-aids to cover my tattoos, and my face mask. So that's all there, and I'm gonna go pack my lunch right now. All right, so as you guys saw, I that's like I showed you what I put in my lunch. So I have watermelon, pineapple, grapes, carrots, and hummus, and like pita, like whole grain pita chips with like sesame seeds in them. And then I have like a bag of Fruit Loops, a bag of Apple Jacks, is that what they're called? Apple Jacks, a granola bar, and a cookie. And then I'm also gonna bring lemon water. So what I'm gonna do now is study all of my week two stuff. Um, it's about 7.45 right now. So I'm gonna do that until about hopefully like 9.30 and then get into bed, do some like practice problems and stuff and hopefully go to bed early. Also, I'm gonna braid my hair because you guys know I have so much hair and it's just a lot to deal with. So whenever I'm like in the hospital setting, clinical, I do like to braid it and then put it in to a bun. So I'm gonna do that in a little bit, but I'm going to let it dry a little bit more get a little bit just so it's kind of like damp a little so i'm like writing stuff out i'm going to erase write it again and i'm like looking at this and then i see if i can like write it out once or twice without looking and then i'll like check my work if that makes sense <laughs> Alright, so this is what my hair looks like. I really don't know how to French braid. Like, this doesn't even look like a French braid. That really doesn't either, but it gets it out of my face, so it's like, okay. And then, what I do... I swear I lose all my hair scrunchies. Well, I just got this cute one from Randy Melville, but I don't want to wear this to the hospital. I, I'm sure my sister has one, but I just, like, tie it up with a hair scrunchie. Um, and I'll probably like bobby pin some pieces to make it look a little bit semi-decent. It's gonna look like a train wreck in the morning anyway because I sleep in it. So I'm gonna put in these earrings. I got them from Nordstrom Rack and- no, no, no. I did not get these from Nordstrom Rack. I got these from Marshalls and I took out my cartilage because we're only allowed to have, um, one set of earrings on, like one on each ear. So that's that and... I don't know, we can liven up my face a little bit with the earrings. I feel like it brightens. It would be nice wearing masks so I can cover up all my acne on my face. I don't know why. I think because I touch my face so much when I study. Okay. So that's that. I'm going to go back to studying. My hair was kind of getting to the point where it was drying. So I wanted to just braid that and get that done. So. All right, you guys, so it is 10, 10 p.m. I finished everything for week two, which is awesome. And the exam is on week one and week two. So I'm gonna lay down and go through and type out everything that I remember from week two that I just like re, you know, went through everything. And yeah, then I'm gonna hopefully get ready for bed. I did take a little nap today. Um. So hopefully I can fall asleep. I have to be up at 5.45. Clinical starts at 6.30. And you guys know I just roll out of bed. I do the bare minimum. <laughs> Alright, good morning you guys. It is 6 a.m. exactly. I'm getting ready to leave. All dressed, had my scrunchie, tattoo covered up, tattoo covered up. And then I have my lunch and everything, my huge water and all of that. So I'm getting ready to leave because I am 
I'm gonna be on time. I have my bag and that's that. So I'm tired. I got like no sleep. I was like tossing and turning the whole night. So yeah. So yeah, I'm tired, but yeah. Okay, hopefully it's a good day. It's cloudy, rainy today, but yeah. Okay guys, it's 6.17. I just got here and I'm getting ready to go in. All right, I just showered. I'm gonna take a nap. Hopefully I wake up and it's not dark out. <laughs> All right, guys, so it is 7.26 p.m. right now. I just grabbed Dunkin'. I really wanted, like, a tea and um, the scrambled sausage bowl, whatever, egg bowl. But my boyfriend and I are going to hang out once he gets off work, and he wants pasta. So I'm going to go get us pasta and um, garlic bread because that's, like, our thing. It's so good. So I'm going to run into the store and get us that right now. I'm so excited to see him. We haven't seen each other in a couple of days like it's been forever so all right you guys so right now i am just going to do my clinical paperwork and you guys this helped me so much today um when i first started working as an aide i literally like use this all the time and this helped so much today when i was taking like notes about the hospital or it's just honestly whatever so i definitely recommend these obviously once you get used to like a facility you may not need to write stuff down but you know sometimes i write down like what they want for breakfast or whatever so yeah but anyway that helped a lot and i got this from amazon i put them in my nursing school supply haul last year i can link them down below it comes with like a bunch of pretty like colors and like two of each color i think so i'm gonna do my clinical paperwork right now i have to do this concept map with like the nursing care plan the diagnoses diagnosis and also like SBAR and um my brain's not working right now and like the written clinical documentation I believe that's what it's called and then we just have some like worksheets and stuff about like delegation and like charting and yeah so that is that I'm gonna do that now this stuff is due next week at like clinical so I'm trying to get it done now so because I had a clinical today so I can remember like stuff about my patient and also because I don't want to be worried about it so I'm gonna get to this and get it done before my boyfriend gets here so we can hang out and eat and stuff so <laughs> So it is the next morning, me and my boyfriend just got some coffee and I am trying to catch up because it is week three now. I finished all the readings, I have one more lecture to watch. So I'm gonna do that now and I'm just pulling this up because I have um, my Zoom meeting in an hour and then I need to focus on studying for my exam that's tomorrow. Please look how horrible <laughs> this is. I literally just wrote that and I messed it up and it just looks so horrible and it's so off-centered and it looks horrible anyway again red was what I added in when I listened to like the pre-recorded lecture and then when we do like the live zooms I add stuff in as well so I added like this here um same there if there's some red I did some more highlighting and then also like I added this and added some like sticky notes and stuff. So I just got out of the shower, I look crazy, and I decided that I wanted to do a face mask. So I'm gonna be using the Timmy Detox Mask, the green tea blend. It's matcha, lemongrass, and clay. I have a discount code, I'll put it right here and down below for you guys if you're interested. It smells so good, it looks like this. So I'm just gonna use this little like mask putter on her thing, I don't know. I got it from Amazon. So, so I thought while I put this on, I will tell you guys about clinical yesterday. So when we like got there and whatnot she kind of like introduced herself told us a little bit about like the clinical the facility and we like went around and like introduced ourselves said like why we wanted to go to nursing what specialty we were thinking and something unique about us i said i have a twin that's like my go-to thing only unique thing about me and we were in there from 6 30 to 9 in like our conference room and then like a worker came in, gave us our badges. She did like a presentation on COVID. We are not going to be treating any COVID patients. I believe there's only like two or three at the hospital on a different wing, she said. We got a tour of the floor that we're working on. And then we 
had lunch that like took up a while had lunch and then we went back onto the floor and we got assigned our patients um and we did it in like groups which i'm not used to um working in groups at clinical so it was interesting now my patient was so sweet and then we did post coffin so we were on the floor like too too long yesterday just because it was like the first day orientation whatever and then we had a post conference for about like an hour and 15 minutes so yeah nothing too crazy yesterday um our focus yesterday was like more so on safety and next week we do like infection immunity pressure ulcers i believe or maybe next week no next week that's week three next week's elimination so yep and i have my exam tomorrow i'm nervous we only have 40 minutes for 40 questions obviously to prevent cheating which i'm freaking out about because it takes me like two to three times to read a question and actually understand it so i'm really worried about that okay guys so me and my dad just put a tv up in my room um i think it looks good but i am gonna watch the east family's new video quickly um i normally don't keep up with our videos but Catherine just had their little boy and they just posted like the part two, I believe, of their video. So it's a lot later. I've just been doing practice questions. It's 11.19 and I found this website, Nurse Labs. I was looking up like questions. So I've been doing questions on here and now I'm doing it on the nursing process. I just did like UTI and elimination questions. Warning. I'm tired. The dogs are barking. I miss my sister um, so much. She's been in Georgia for the past one, two, four days and she's on her way to Florida now. And I wish I was going on vacation instead of taking an exam. I don't know how some people wake up and they look like good. <laughs> it's just what I look like. So, I need to get up. I'm so sleepy. I was going to take my exam before lab, but then I was like, you know, I'm just going to take it after. So, that's what I'm doing. So, yeah. I was up late studying, and then, as you saw, I turned on the office. But I need to sleep. So, yeah, I want to get up and get ready for lab. This is what I'm wearing. I'm literally wearing what I wore to bed. So, yeah. Um... These pants have like slowly shrunk. So my mom says it looks like I'm waiting for the flood. So that's that. I have my bags and I'm ready to go. I'm tired. I've had some breakfast and then we are off to lab for four hours. Yay. <laughs> All right, guys, so I just got done with lab and I did an hour of like practice. We need for our checkoffs for Foley, uh, insertion and removal of female and male and grabbing a sterile urine specimen. So that's that, I'm hot. I was freezing in there, now I'm hot. And a couple of the people that did take the exam so far today have failed the exam and said it was hard. So that's what I'm worried about, so. I need to go home, study a little bit more, get organized. And then later, I think me and my boyfriend are going to get food. I'm about to take my exam. I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh. So I got an 80% on my exam. I'm feeling a little bummed because... I don't know. I'm just like disappointed in myself. Because I thought I could have done a lot better. It was really hard. It's probably one of the hardest exams I've taken. I was not expecting it to be that hard. I don't know if they're making it harder because like it's online or something. But, um, yeah. All right, you guys. So, I don't know if you can see me. Hi, I just hopped out of the shower. I'm going to my boyfriend's. We're going to get food. Swim in his hot tub. You guys, look at the moon. Oh, my God. Okay, now I'm not going to focus, of course. Ah, it looks just like my tattoo. It's so pretty. Oh, my gosh. Look at this beautiful sunset. Gosh. My boyfriend's watching my videos. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. So it is 7.23 a.m. I just left my boyfriend's. He had work this morning at 7. So yeah, I'm at Dunkin'. I'm going to get 
me and my dad a coffee, Xander some little donut holes, and then my mom a donut because my mom doesn't like coffee. I love waking up early when the sun's coming through, like so bright. So um, I'm going to quickly tidy up my room. This is for me studying, doing work yesterday. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm obsessed with my TV. So yeah, I'm going to tidy this up and then get to doing some lecture. <laughs> Okay guys, so this is what I got so far. I started here. So we have this and this. And I am flipping to this side. And I also put on some jazz music. So we are being very productive. It's taken me a while, but I have about 11 minutes left of the lecture. Okay, so it's almost one. I fell back asleep once I did my notes and watched some videos that I needed to for class so I these are my breakfast this is my breakfast water and I am about to have my zoom lecture I have just been cleaning my room for the past couple of hours um I was doing like a super deep clean I went through like my drawer drawers I cannot speak and I always like to wipe down like all my makeup products and stuff this is like my everyday makeup drawer um and I have like my other makeup over there but yeah I like to wipe down all my products because I feel like they get like messy and dirty and I don't know I just that bothers me and I, I I like taking care of my stuff and keeping it nice and like something like for that is just like making sure all everything's like wiped down because like if I get foundation on my hands and then it gets on the drawers or in the makeup it's just like me liking stuff clean um so yeah and I was just watching some like true crime videos on my tv while i was doing that so it doesn't really look clean right here on the floor i have to throw some of that those towels in the laundry take out the trash and then i did just um get all the dead skin and peach fuzz off my face and i did my eyebrows which they still look pretty crazy but yeah i just need to clean up my purse because there's like receipts in there and then i'm gonna move on to the bathroom i went to the dollar tree today to get this like scrubber it's for dishes but i thought it'd be easy to like scrub my shower because i want to give it like a really good deep clean and yeah so that's what we're gonna do okay so the bathroom is clean this is just stuff in here drying that's Santa's wash rag that is staying from his hair dye and this is what it looks like nice and shiny and clean so I'm about to shower right now because Lord knows I need it. Good morning, you guys. It's 8.50. I have a lash appointment at 9. This is what my lashes look like before. I haven't had extensions in so long. And my sister always gets them and they look so good. So I'm going to get mine done just because why not treat myself a little bit. So yeah. All right, you guys, so they are done. I love them. It's 10.10. I'm gonna get some Starbucks. So I got a venti pink drink light on ice. The line was so long, but yeah, so I'm obviously home right now and I'm babysitting Xander today and just gonna do like my readings and lectures and that's pretty much it. Um, same for the weekend, just studying, getting stuff done. And I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because it's already so long um i was editing like all night so yeah but i love you guys so much thank you guys so much for all your love and support always it means so much to me it just makes my heart so happy and it motivates me to you know keep pushing so i love you guys and if you have any video requests make sure you leave them down below make sure you subscribe if you're not already and give this video a thumbs up i love you guys so so much and i'll see you in my next video bye